Um, Lorraine and Alicia, hold on one second because Dan Halley's standing by. We do have earnings from Zoom Video. They are trading down after market. What's going on? Dan, I think you might be muted. Um, I should. Uh, can you hear me now? We got gotcha. you. OK, uh, they had a beat on the top and bottom line. Uh, we have 956 million for revenue uh, versus 910 million uh, expected. And then on the earnings per share, we have a dollar thirty two versus ninety nine cents. Importantly, looking forward into the second quarter, uh, they beat estimates there as well. Uh, they're looking for between a dollar to a dollar fourteen, a uh, dollar fourteen to a dollar fifteen on earnings per share versus ninety four cents uh, is what was originally expected. And then for revenue, we're looking at. 984 million to 999 million. The expectation was for 941 million. So uh, they beat there, but you can uh, tell obviously the stock price off as much as uh, three to four percent right now. I think going forward, the stock is really going to depend on the kind of customers that they're continuing to hold on to, uh, whether they can carry over uh, those customers from companies that are 10 or more employees, uh, as well as the ones that spend more than 100,000 for the trailing 12 months. Those are the ones that are really going to be important. The consumers who were using it uh, for the pandemic didn't put much uh, into the revenue at the end of the day. It comes down to those businesses. We'll see going forward uh, into the uh, Q3 and Q4 if they hold on there uh, and Zoom can count them as customers going forward. Uh, for now, though, looking like a beat for uh, obviously Q1 and then for expectations for Q2. All right, Dan Howley, thank you very much.